Howdy Hyperspinners, Zavar here coming at you with a quick tip to help you get the most out of your front-end experience. A member just asked what the best way to keep your main menu organized was. Some of us expressed that we use either chronological order or that we organize our systems by type or both. With over 140 different systems in my standard main menu XML, I like to take it one step further by adding a visual reference to help other users orient themselves both initially and while the wheel is spinning. This is a reference wheel theme I very quickly threw together as a proof of concept. Basically, my hyperspan always starts on this map wheel, which tells users that if they go up, they'll get computer systems, then handhelds, etc. And if they go down, they'll be at arcade, then pinball, then console, and so on. If you wanted to do something like this for yourself, there's really no limit to how you could present your map, and this is a very quick, simple demo. Another thing I do is I use the auto custom tool to give each type of system a different generic but visually appealing background. This solves two problems. First, it makes every wheel image easy to read no matter what background it's on, and second, the sudden change in the wheel background color stands out while hyperspinning at max speed, so you can easily identify when you've reached the next section of systems. You can see I went for a space theme, but you could set this up with any aesthetic you'd like, even going so far as to match your cabinet decoration or home decor. We'll go more into depth with the tools we use to make this happen in future official tutorials. In the meantime, thanks for watching and I hope some of you found this tip helpful. Have a great day.